machine. Yeah, Let's go. Start. Where's the calculator go? 97, 98. Yeah, Do the card sick. Yeah. It's kind of cool when a kid can look into a showcase and sit there and say, I want that Chet Holmgren rookie and it's five bucks. Crazy, it says one of one. It's not a one of one, is it? How long have you been coming here? Well, when I had hair. Wow. <laughs> We're at Burbank Sports Cards for another day of buying, selling, and fun at the happiest place in the hobby. And check this out. Burbank Sports Cards customer parking only. And I got a freaking spot. There's only one, two, three, four. There's six spots. Usually I don't get a spot here. There's usually the six spots are taken, not by the employees, by the customers. There's always a filled lot here. But we're here in Burbank, California. Love this place. I told you guys I'll be here every single week, buying, selling, creating content, hanging out with Rob. Rob said he had a surprise for me from one of my viewers and he said it's perishable, which means I had to come get it today. So we'll see what it is. Here we go. Got the Burbank card show coming up. Check it out. 15 through the 18th, you guys gotta come through. 15, 16, 17, 18. Also gonna be hosting the kids event there. So that link will be down below. You guys gotta check it out. Hey, what's going on, man? What up, what up? Not much, brother. Let's go. How much did you want for everything? Uh, I don't know. The lady will kill me if I come back. The lady <laughs> will kill you. Yes. Uh, so are you leaving the hobby or? Yeah, kind of. Why? Um, just with work, school, just got. Too expensive. Priorities. More buying, less, less selling. So yeah, was, I feel it. Yeah. Maybe one day I'll come back. You better come back. We better yes, see you back. They always come back. They always come <laughs> back. Henry Ruggs base card. There oh you go. Gosh. Nice. Where the money's at. Yeah. We donate a lot of this type of stuff. Yeah. Darius Geis, Deion Kane, Rashad Bateman, Jordan Lastly. This is what I call long-term inventory. <laughs> Gotta really find the right needle in a haystack, dude. Sir. Yeah, we got Jalen Hurts, Najee Harris. Give me 80 bucks. That works for me. We'll do that. 80 bucks. Let's do that. Done. Easy. Steve will get you the money. Thank you. Thank you, sir. You got it. Look at that. It's like... It's hey, Dad. 80 bucks? 80? Uh-huh. It's like a TV show. Yeah, I mean, there's probably $300 retail here, but there's so much effort involved in taking this unsorted stuff, getting into a system, scanning it, pricing it, databasing it, inner sorting it into stock, pulling it, shipping it for free. Yeah, that's kind of the way you have to buy this stuff, and a lot of it we just donate, where it's... 2012 commons take it easy man. and we donate we just build up triple shoes and we donate it it's what i call a labor deal it's not just easy slabs oh i'll pay you 75 percent for this and that tag it put it out this stuff takes a while and it might be three months until i even see the 80 bucks that we put into this and and over time we'll see the profits roll but it's just one of those deals. But, you know, you got to do these quick, too. You know, there was no autos, there was no jerseys, no serial numbered stuff, so. When we film these deals, when the shoe boxes start coming out and it's a lot of chud, random stuff, mm -hmm. they usually call you in. Well, they can do it if it's all really modern stuff, but it's all kind of mixy. And it all goes on my floor. I'm the one that actually deals with all this stuff. And um, maybe... 15% of these cards we actually have some kind of use for. The rest of it, a lot of it gets donated, just kind of stacked up, given away, because the money that you're gonna pour into this, when you've already got the cards, and they're low demand cards at that, when you're paying 15, 16, 20, 25 bucks an hour to these people, you'll never see that money again. Now you're adding all that labor onto what you originally paid for it, and the cards just aren't gonna sell because you already own them and they're not really selling. If you're a card shop and you're not buying, you're not you're not gonna be growing. So what how what it stress the importance of buying cards as a card shop? You buy a lot of cards. If you don't buy, you die. Nobody wants to walk into a shop and see the same stuff every day. You see these folks, what are they looking at? The sneak preview showcases. They weren't here this morning. They're all brand new cards. I'm not a manufacturer. I don't make the cards. We need to purchase them constantly so that we have people in these showcases constantly gaining that FOMO of what's new. This deal, unfortunately, isn't going in any of the showcases. Some of it's going online. 
Um, and a lot of it's just going somewhere cheaper for free. But a shop that's not buying, a shop that doesn't have people on a list selling you cards, it's been a light day. We do anywhere from 20 to 55 deals a day. And customers are my distributors. What's a distributor? They bring in something to a store that they can resell supposedly for a profit. Stores that don't buy, I don't get the point of, uh, of going to them. Stores that don't have fresh inventory, I don't get the point of going to them. What do we got? You tell me it's perishable. I, I don't know what this is, but I do know who it's from. I see John and Lisa from Baseball Card Connection. Lisa um, wanted to send this to you, and she sent it here. I don't know exactly what it is. Nicest people in the hobby. Look at this. That's for you. Oh, wow. It looks like freshly baked goods. Are you kidding me? Dude. <laughs> this is the love that Mojo gets. Hope these homemade muffins oh. survive shipping. Well, nice. They did, definitely. Look at that. They know how to pack it. They know how to pack it. And what else is here? Oh, this is cool. I want to try one of those muffins. Oh, this is for me. All right, you got to open it. Rob? Uh, Rob, looks like a box of tissues, maybe. No, it's Happy Valentine's Day. All right, let's, let's crack it up. Thank you for helping Lisa and John. Oh, dude, oh. we got some mini muffins here. Okay. Uh, it looks like lemon poppy seed, maybe? Not sure. Those look good. You, gotta, you have to try one. This is crazy. This is great. And then there's a big box in here with a ribbon. This will make it a little snuggly. Extra oh, here snuggly. We go. How happy housewarming gift. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, oh dude. dude. Snuggle blanket. Snuggle blanket wow. for Jay. Oh, this is, this, I might have to keep this myself. Oh, this is my so gosh. nice. I mean, who does this? This is incredible. Who does this? The baseball card connection does baseball this. Baseball card connection does wow. this. Wow. Thank you guys so oh, much. Add it to the PC and tell them what the PC is. Weirded graded um, cards. We have comes. different graded cards. This came in yesterday. MGS grading. And this one came in yesterday, 3D grading, which I guess is actually current because that's a new card. My favorite, though, is Snaggletooth grading. Another one. Yeah. Yeah. We have over 60 different graded cards. Um, I don't know how many grading companies are out there. I'm hoping to get to 100, which would be crazy. Um, so many grading companies popped up during the pandemic and have since gone away, or they popped up 20 years ago. Um, I just get so excited when I see a slab I haven't gotten before. I can get a Kobe auto through here, and yeah, that's cool, and we get those. But when I see a, a crappy slab, I'm like, oh my God, I don't have that, and I add it to my collection, it just means a lot more. So, yeah, I'm a hobbyist at heart, too. He's looking for the 65 rows, yeah. 65 banks. You completing some sets? Mickey Lowlitz. I Yeah, he knows. He, he knows. knows. He knows my deal. 10, 40, How long have you been coming 10. here? Long time. Long when time. I had hair. Wow. <laughs> that is a long together. time ago. <laughs> Rob's, ma Rob's making here. deals. I'm not gonna tell my I'm not gonna tell my lady. <laughs> <laughs> How many times a day do you hear that? I'm not telling mine either. <laughs> <laughs> I've been married twice. He's yeah. smarter. I'm smarter. I don't know about that. That's awesome. So so Rob's out here doing deals. Legit. Like that's pretty good. Wait, who you got for the Super Bowl, Rob? Yeah. What's that? Who's winning the Super Bowl? Kansas City. And what'd you say about Mahomes? You don't bet against him. Damn! You don't bet against him. He's going to be the GOAT. You don't Let's bet go. against that. Well, we're going to take a look at the sneak preview showcases. These cards were literally not here this morning. We rotate them Monday through Friday, literally 50 weeks a year, 260 times a year. These showcases rotate. So these cards went in this morning. They're only here today. They get yanked out. They get processed tomorrow. We go IG live and then they go online and we put another 250 cards wow. in every damn day. And you'll see the quality. That's the raw showcase there. We got great price points. These are Tani's. But yeah. But then you're going to see, you know, huge Kobe's. Wow. So these sneak previews, again, only last a day. It's not how many showcases you have. It's how fresh you can keep them and how much you can rotate them. Again, there's about 160 cards per showcase. You rotate them 250 times a year. You start doing the math of how many cards can run through a showcase. These are the daily new arrivals. So last yesterday was Thursday, and of course people are always looking at these because they're the freshest cards. Excuse me, young man. So this is the Thursday new arrival showcase. So these cards weren't out here this morning. These literally went in right before opening, and you'll see the kind of quality. Oh, look at this Wemby, 10-10. Fire. Yeah, it's literally 
These showcases get re recycled once a week. So you can get an idea of just how many cards go through a little amount of showcases. So it's not how many showcases. You can have five showcases, but you got to keep them fresh, keep them rotating, and keep them clean and organized. Errol Spence Jr. autograph. What? Red ink? That's fire. Old Shador Sanders. Not know about my card show? Raise your hands. Dumbass Jay. No, Mojo, you know about it. All right, that's gonna be a big party, folks. We got some Mexican food here. Right. We order food in every day. It's hard for people to get away here, so we buy everybody lunch every day. Old Triple Threads Auto, Andre Godal. That's actually a really cool card. Dual ga Triple Game Use Jersey Auto. Classic Jason Richardson, Dunk Champ. I think this card's really cool. Old Derek Fisher, not a Laker fan, but and look at that, Juju Watkins refractor on, that's pretty cool too. Nothing like being in the fishbowl. That's where all the slabs are. Look at that. A Randy Whitman autograph PSA slab for 10 bucks. Would you guys buy it or would you leave it? Siku Dumbia, no. TJ Warren, Wayman Tisdale, look at that. Any 86 clear sets out there? I feel like this card's been in here since 2020, <laughs> or sorry, yeah, 2021. Digging for deals. James Wiseman, he's starting to play pretty well. Cedric Maxwell, James Wiseman. Jordan Noir, purple. Ooh, Brandon Miller. Oh, look at this card. Macal Austin Langford. It's a cool looking card. Don't know the player though. He's from Boston College. If you're a Boston College fan, that's a cool buy for 15 bucks, right? RJ Barry, he's been playing pretty well with Toronto. Not really liking the selection right now. I think we got cleaned out. We're here on like a Friday, so typically Tuesdays and Wednesdays, they're pretty loaded up. Seen a lot of 87 Fleer, man. If anybody's into 87 Fleer, this is the box for you. I guess we got autographs. We got Death Dyer, 15 bucks. Got some baseball. Well, Wander Franco, we're gonna not buy that. Jaron Duran, pink blue. It's crazy, it says one of one. It's not a one of one, is it? Let's see this, let's see, let's see it. Look at this, somebody has one up for 1253. Oh, that's ridiculous. Not the right price, there's no way it's that expensive. This may be a one, I think I found a one of one. Oh, the Ian Anderson, there it is, six dollars. Well, you know what, I can say I found a one of one. I might buy this, I don't know. It's not like, see, seeing the CJ Abrams go for 20, it's like, what do you guys think? Would you have bought it? Reese Hoskins, Nick Williams. I might buy that for my PC. Is it numbered? I'm going to pick this up. Little Reese Hoskins. He's on the Brewers now. I went to high school with him. He is one of my PCs, so. Wow, Ricky Henderson, a Yankees uniform. Samuel Munoz, blue. Free agent for the Dodgers. 15 bucks. PSA 10 on platinum. Let's see. Let's just look up a sold listing. So this isn't, this is just quicker for me to look it up, but I just want to see what they have on here. I mean, that's not bad. Twelve ninety nine for this right here, for the base card. Let's see. Let's see how much I can buy it for now. I mean, for fifteen bucks, and I'll realistically I can get it for like ten to twelve. It's a color match, true blue. I mean, this guy could be the next big thing, right? I mean, he's a uh, he's from the Dominican Republic, outfielder. He's born in two thousand four. I'm gonna take a chance on this kid. So that's cool. It's cool. For Mike Soroka. This would have been a big card when he was booming. Black refractor. I'm not sure what he's doing now, but. Like I said, would have been a big. Shane Bieber, another guy. He was crushing in the MLB. Chase Petty. Wilson Bennett. Check this out. Little Mike Schmidt from 85. Dang, look at that Bob Abreu. Don't make cards like they used to, right? A little Tom Glavin. Like little, I think it's a Fleer rookie. So I'm not crazy about looking up a bunch of cards all the time, but sometimes I like to see if it's a rookie or not, or I like to do my research. I've gotten this card signed before a couple times. I always thought it was the rookie, but I think, yeah, it is a rookie. It's actually not a bad deal. I mean, I've literally spent, I've bought this card for $4 raw and gotten it signed. So I might just buy that just for, on principle. Vlad Guerrero, stamped bonus. It's an SSP. Lars Newtbar. He was killing, I think, before injury. So this is yeah, card ladder. Just, Go on here. Know. Let's just look up Lars Newt Bar negative. It'll show me all the last sales and it'll verify them as well. So card ladder, it's a paid service, but this is one of the best ones in my opinion. They're the most honest. So I mean, look at that. A negative, a negative just sold for sixteen ninety nine. Then it sold for five bucks, five dollars and twenty cents, eight fifty. So eight fifty five. It's probably like a $10 card raw, $20 graded nine. If it was a 10, I would have bought it. Still, if you're a Cardinals fan, probably would have bought it. This one's probably a buy for me. Dustin May Blue, kind of a fun card. 
10 bucks. There you go, another Dodger. Lava Refractor. The Lava Raw did 199. Let's see what a PSA. So it's already a PSA 10. I mean, it's a PSA 10. Once again, fun cards, Dodgers, prospects. With these guys, I mean, this guy was born in 2000, 17 free agent. You never know, right? Glaber Torres. Bobby Dalback, White Wave, Greg Maddox, little Shane Bieber prospects. Pitchers don't do well generally when we're buying cards. How about this kid, Jake Rucker, little seventh rounder. So let's we'll look, we'll put these guys to look up. I love looking up the prospects, see what they're doing. Some of these prospects could be big coming into spring training. Dang, well Billy Ripken autograph. It's not the F face card, but low key kind of cool. If this was the F face card, I mean this still might be. Worth buying. Clemens. Look at that. Jason Dominguez for 15 bucks. These are pretty good. Price of grading right here. He's legit. It's gonna be a nice boom for his stuff. Plays well. We'll see. I'm gonna take a chance. Spencer Jones. Here we go. Little mojo. Little Jackie Robinson. 89 reprint insert Bowman. That's a cool one. I'm probably gonna buy that. Javier Baez. Remember how good he was? That's a cool buy. Might buy that. Oh man, this is a buy right away. Are you kidding me? Coco Goff for 15 bucks. She killed the US Open. 15 bucks for a graded insert rookie, like all day long. Here's a Paul Craig autograph. We'll look into that. Lennox Lewis, that's sick. Lennox Lewis again. Let's look, we'll look into those. Holyfield versus Foreman. That's kind of cool. Boxing car. So the red auto did $12, $15, $15, and $5. So there's none graded. I mean, it's not. It's not terrible. I don't know anything about him though. I get to research who these people actually are. Like I'm gonna learn about Paul Craig today. I would have never learned about this guy. Paul Craig is a martial artist who completes the middleweight division competitor since 2013. Let's see what his record is. So this kid is 17, this kid, he's 36 years old. 17 wins, seven losses and one draw. He's been fighting for a while, but he lost on November 18th versus Allen. The guy was 23 and five, so tough fight, but we got root for this guy. All right, so these Lennox Lewis's, it's not really a graded car, a particularly graded car. I'm gonna take a chance and buy one of them. Legend. Okay, it's 14.99 PSA 9, stop me. I'll tell you what, here's what here's what our buys will be. I'm gonna pass on the Dustin, man. I'm gonna pass on the Glavin. I'm gonna take a chance on the two Dodgers guys. I'm picking up, and I'm gonna pass on the Dominguez. I'm gonna pick up a different Dominguez card in the showcase, I think deal going here. Leonard, little Samuel Munoz, Reese Hoskins for my PC, Coco Goff, Paul Craig, and Lennox Lewis. So, and also guys, you got to check out our whatnot just to show you guys. Look at this. We're live. I mean, look at our page right here. Mojo Sports, go follow us. If you want $10 to spend, use that link down below. There's $10 there. But honestly, all you guys have to do is look, go to show. We're on shows right here. You go to our page. Bookmark our streams. You got Zach going live at two o'clock on two four. I'm going live on every Wednesday, so I'll be live at four thirty. And uh, look at that. We already got our pre-scheduled. So make sure you click this. You see this bookmark button? I'm gonna click bookmark and notify. And then if you go in our streams, we'll put some buy it nows in there. So check out our whatnots. A lot of these cards will be featured and cards from the show. Justin Bieber and Drake. SGC ten. We gotta take that. Are you kidding me? The Persian sensation right here. This is like the coolest thing I've ever found here. That's a buy for 35. Has Vula. Dang, Zay Flowers. He had a tough game, but it's a cool card. Look at that NT right there, little Jordan Love. My favorite price point right now is between $2 and $125. Oh, Emmett Smith. Oh, that's a buy. Black and white checkered. It's Kobe Bryant. Four out of 25, Miggy. Oh, Walker Beer, Sepia. That's a cool looking card. Seems like a really good deal. Three fifty for a Bill Russell. All right, once you go eat, once you roll over there, and I'll take care of this, okay? Yeah, it's cool. Full roster in here. It's crazy. Yeah. Dude, best card shop in the world. What do you want, man? Steph Curry, one of one. I see this card right here. Sometimes I know that people see your guys' stuff on eBay, and they're like, they want to buy it immediately. Right. They want to make an offer. And I see a card right here. So it's the AJ Dillon Flawless. Mm -hmm. So I want to buy that. Okay. So it's on eBay. So once it scans and buys, does it get sold on what happens? Yeah, it comes off immediately. We have a scanner at the register. As soon as we hit it, 
There's a little bit of a delay, a lag, but it's not very long. And then it comes off and eBay. It's zapped off eBay if it, as it sells in store. It has to. Yeah, if you can't increment and decrement your inventory, you're in trouble. These showcases here by Sport, and these are things that we pick up real fast. I just get them gun real fast, get them in here. Stuff ranges from about $5 to $45. It's kind of cool when a kid can look into a showcase and sit there and say, I want that Chet Holmgren rookie and it's five bucks. Um, we just, I can't keep them full. I mean, it's, yeah, there's some great cards. I mean, look at that. Jason Richardson autograph, 15 bucks. Yeah. It seems like what, five to 25 is pretty good in here? Yeah, everything good in here. You just have to do the work. Yeah. You have to make it accessible and you have to continue to buy and process every single day. RJ Barrett out of 10. The locals, the boys. <laughs> what are we looking at here? Look at this Herbert Crossroads. Big one. Trying to, yeah. He's interested in a few of our cards, so trying to make something happen. Still, it's gonna be a big card at the national. Yeah, good done, boys. It's a ooh. Okay. So what they did, they put a f dent in it that you can get to through the front, and they pinched the edge. <laughs> what was it before this? It was well. This was encased. I bought oh. this card from Ryan for six hundred bucks, oh. and then and then I sent it to SGC, and they. Wow, like this nice little Corey Seeger, World Series champ, Don Larson. Look at this. I like these game yeah, used battles. Yeah. Twenty bucks, like. It's awesome. Can't beat that kind of stuff, dude. So I see you guys are loading up. You got Jordan here. We loading loading up a shoe right now. What are we loading up for? What are we getting? Here? Man, we're loading up for Saturday stream, which is tomorrow. Where are you streaming at? On whatnot on cream cards. Cream cards. Give me a follow. Yeah. And tell me about whatnot. Like how how do you you come here to supply and sell and whatnot? Yeah, I come over here. I grab supplies. I grab some cards. Meet some people in the community. Obviously, with some common faces and just basically hang out. Some Zion patch. Ooh, I like that. Halliburton patch. That's a good one. It's a rookie. Your rookie Bron. Patch De'Aaron. Supernova Luca. Nikola patch again. This is awesome. <laughs> some cool stuff. Trey. Slabs. Jordan, Braun, a couple Burrows, Mahomskis, another Burrow rookie. Oh, nice Man one. of the hour, yeah. Couple Good things. Couple so things. I get a lot of people asking me, like, they, they want to make whatnots and join. What advice do you have to somebody that's trying to get on whatnot and, like, become a seller? Don't be scared. Don't be scared. I was definitely intimidated by streaming. And a lot of people, the feedback I get from most people is that people are scared to stream. They don't really know where to start or what to do. I was the same. I would just be one of those like serial swipers and I would buy and then, you know, one day I decided I was going to do it. And um, it's been great for me so far. I have a good time. Yeah. I would recommend just jump off and do it. Don't be scared. Let's go, bro. That's awesome. Very nice, Kobe. That used to be my LA sports cards in here. What's good? Oh, Let's man. Go. <laughs> that is. What is. Look at From 1998. So this is a true one. So this is a true one of one. Brady Blue Refractor. This Kobe die cut. Die cuts are tough to grade too. Dang, dude, that's. The KG. Yeah, Open five boxes, it got some decent hits. What was the big card? It was the Busquets out of 10 and uh, the Noel Buck out of 10 auto. It's a $200 card. Let me see the Messi. Messi variation. Dang, let's go. Yes, sir. Guys close in on the deal. 950. Corey Seeger, Don Larson, Gold. Shout out to the UFC fans. Colby Covington out of 10. Brandon Moreno, White Sparkle. Steph Curry, one of one. More. Show you Otani, that's a cool one. Couple Bobby Miller refractors. Jalen Tolbert, nice six out of nine. Kenneth Walker, look at that patch. Davis out of 10. Old Jay Rich Otto. Keandre Ayton, this is a cool one. Juju Watkins. Corbin Carroll, Christian Yellick. Anthony Volpe. Some rookies, George St. Pierre, legend. Shout out to Canada. <laughs> I thought this was funny, Chris Christie Otto. Peter Yawn patch. This was my favorite one, Bill Russell Auto. Picked up some slabs. Jose Canseco Auto. Great, you guys will stand off all of our stuff. AJ Dillon. Yeah, yeah, okay. Goldie McCovey patch. Had to pick up the Beaver Drake. 
my boy Ryan. Yo. Thank you. Good deal. All right, let's go. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Ray, legend. Appreciate it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like, leave a comment, don't forget to subscribe. You guys, we're live on Whatnot every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. You guys gotta click those links. Sign up for the link. You'll get your first $10 to spend on us. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll talk to you guys later. See you for the next video. Peace.